YouTube, what's up? HD Rome here, filming in a higher quality this time. Why I don't know, but I want to talk about some, I want to talk about something real quick, man. Um, I feel like gamers are the most entitled pieces of crybabies I ever seen. I really believe that. There's a ton of topics that I could talk about and reasons when it when it when it comes to just these entitlement crybabies complaints, right? It's tons of stuff that I could say. But one thing that um that really triggered me was that I just watched a video from a certain YouTuber and uh he was crying about the file sizes in the PS5. Now yeah, the file size, I mean the the storage, the storage space in this PS5. Not file sizes sizes, but the storage space. So you know, everybody knows that the PS5 I think has like 100, 825 gigabytes. And then when it's allocated to the OS, it, it gives you like 600 or something. A little over 600. And uh, he's crying. He's crying about it. But it's it's not just a regular hard drive that, that's in this, in this thing. It's a SSD. So it has basically two functions. It actually works as a uh, game storage and it also works as like like it can work as like extra ram or something like it does it, it it's, it's just so it makes games run a lot better and all kinds of stuff it's just it's a tons of tons of benefits to having an SSD and and therefore it's expensive SSDs are expensive they have always been expensive this is not new stuff. So either look, you're gonna cry about 600 uh, gigabytes of storage, or Sony can be like, "Hey, we'll put a two terabyte in there and charge your dumb ass a thousand dollars for a PS5." He was already crying, and that's the thing, though. The same guy was already crying about five hundred dollars for a PS5. I don't know if I got too much money. I don't know. It's like, what the, what? You can't have, that's the thing though. Like you can't have stuff both ways. There has to be compromises. If you want something, you have to compromise for it. That's just a law of life. If you want anything, if you want success, if you want anything, you have to sacrifice. You have to compromise in order to get it. You can't just have everything just because you can. You know, it just does not work that way. You know? They made the storage expandable. If you want more storage, eventually you'll be able, you'll be able to buy more storage. They'll cry about that. Oh, it's $200 for extra storage. It's an SSD. I don't get it. I don't get it, man. Cause let's say, let's just say Sony put in a, a two terabyte SSD because gamers need extra storage. The console be a thousand dollars. Oh, that's too much money. What's wrong with people, bro? What is wrong with people? I just don't get it. Crybabies. So what? The PS5 is going to be... So what? Even with the Xbox Series X having that SSD uh, expansion. It's an SSD. It's an SSD. I, just, I don't understand, man. I don't get it. You want something? You got to pay for it. You got to buy it. Sony could have did it, but they know you, you wouldn't buy it. Sony could have put in a two terabyte SSD because gamers need storage, but you clowns won't buy it. <laughs> I don't get it. 2006, the PlayStation, Sony put out the PlayStation 3. It was a technical beast of a console. Four USB ports, a Blu-ray disc drive, a, 
um, full backwards compatibility with all games. Wireless controllers, CXs with batteries built in the controller. You didn't have to stick batteries in it. It had an HDMI port, built-in Wi-Fi, 60 gigabytes of storage. The thing was a monster. It cost Sony $800 or $900 or something like that to make them damn things. So they was losing like $300 per console. And y'all, y'all cried about that. You cried. I don't understand. They nerfed the damn thing. Took all the internals out of there. You know, the, the backwards compatibility, the PS2, they yanked it out of there. Took the two USB points. They uh, draw, uh, two, two USB ports out. They nerfed the hell out of it just so it can sell. Or, you know what? It was actually selling, to be quite honest. I think the thing was, this this bullshit, it was a bullshit narrative. That's what it, the bullshit narrative just took off. Oh, the PlayStation 3 is just too much money, it's just too much. But no one's focusing on the, 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 uh, the, no one's focusing on the value. No one's focusing on the value of what you're getting. Everybody's focusing on the price. Same here with the PS5. You're getting value. They got to do whatever they can do to cut costs. Same with the PS4. They had to cut costs somewhere. So they put, to make the games look pretty, they put a fat, beefy GPU in it. And then they nerfed the CPU. So we got amazing visuals out of the PS4. Yeah, a lot of games ran at 30 frames a second, but did it really matter? The games were great. You entitled crybaby mother. Man, y'all some, man, I just don't get it. Can we be happy? I can get criticizing. I get that. Nothing wrong with being critical. But there's another, it's just something else to just be a fucking crybaby. Crybaby ass. You crybabies. Anyways, that's all I wanted to say. You want something, you pay for it. That's all it is. Quit crying. This is 600 gigabytes. So? Buy extra storage. Weak ass. All right, man. Rome, I'm gone.